Hi, my name is Dr. Andrew McIntosh. I'm a food engineer at the University of Florida. My laboratory explores how we can use the principles of food engineering to best make food safer, make it more nutritious, and make it more available to everybody who's going to be consuming food, which is all of us. I enjoy teaching because we have the opportunity to combine lectures with laboratories and students who have a very solid background in a lot of the attributes I need. In food science, we need students with all kinds of different backgrounds. We need biologists, economists, marketers. All of these different backgrounds add to the overall experience of my class. My name is Megan. I recently graduated with my bachelor's degree in food science. I did a small stint at First Magnitude Brewing Company here in town. Basically, I was hired on as an intern, working in the quality control, quality assurance department, baking beer samples, instituting somewhat of a HACCP plan, making sure that there was no contamination or anything like that. It was a very rewarding experience. What we're gonna be doing in our research is basically looking at varietals of tropical pumpkins and their potential for becoming a commodity that's grown in northern parts of Florida. Well, my name is Mario Guadalupe. I am from Ecuador. I got a food engineering degree back in my country, and I recently got a food science PhD degree from the University of Florida. What a food scientist does in the industry is to be in charge of whatever happens to the food product from the field to the table. And within that production chain, we can be in charge of the production line, the quality of the product, the sensory of the product. And also lately, we have been involved in the innovation and reformulation of some products. Uh, my name is Cameron Carilio. I'm a food science master's student in the food engineering program at UF. I got my undergrad degree in food science at UF also, so I'm a double gator. My primary research interest is fermentation, especially within the mechanics of beer processing. My research focuses on turning spent yeast from beer fermentations and incorporating that into fish feed for aquaculture production. Fish feed is largely unsustainable because of fish being used in fish feed, so we're trying to place that in sections with yeast as protein. Hello, my name is Nick Windrick. I recently graduated from the University of Florida Food Science program in August 2020, and I'm set to start my master's program also in food science in August 2021. What makes food science interesting to research is that there's a direct effect to people and to the world because everybody has to eat. So making sure that food is sustainable and safe and delicious as well as healthy for you is something that a food scientist is involved with. And that's really cool, being able to help feed the world in a responsible manner. So hello, my name is Skylar Moreno. I am a first year graduate student here at the University of Florida. My area of interest includes food science with a specialty in sensory science. I'm currently working towards my master's in food science at the University of Florida, focusing on identifying the attributes of tropical pumpkin cultivars in both natural and processing applications. With the help of plant geneticists and food scientists, our team of researchers desire to cultivate the ideal tropical pumpkin that can thrive within the unique Florida climate. Through sensory Sensory taste panels and volatile research, I plan on highlighting the different characteristics within the provided cultivars in order to consolidate an ideal product for consumers. By conducting and publishing these findings, our team can bring forth a new market for Florida farmers to pursue and provide another familiar yet specialty item in stores. What I love about food science is pulling from different disciplines to create a, a product such as beer. It gives us this ability to be creative and problem solve within this really rigorous uh, scientific and academic structure. You're never gonna get pigeonholed in the career. There's always gonna be opportunities available to you. You have to mix all these fields and apply them in real scenarios, either in the laboratory on, or in the industry. Everything is always up and coming and changing. Nothing is ever going to stay exactly the same as what it used to be. I really like food science. I like applying my training in engineering to food science because it allows me to explore the unknown.